morning. I'm Rahel Solomon with your morning digital news brief for Monday, January 8th. There is another deadly house fire in Philadelphia. The call came in early this morning to the 800 block of North Holly Street in Belmont. That's in the West Philadelphia section. Firefighters quickly put out the flames, but one person died inside the home. This is the city's third fire death so far this year. A Philadelphia firefighter and a civilian died in a North Philadelphia house fire on Saturday. And Philadelphia's water department has now fixed 11 water mains in just the last two days. Overnight, they shut off the water line at 54th and Ray Street in West Philly. It's a scene that too many people in and around Philadelphia have been dealing with since the bitter blast moved into the region. And a man and a dog are fine after they were stranded on an icy creek in Wilmington. First responders rushed to Brandywine Creek near South Park Drive and South Market Street last night. A man attempting to save the stranded dog, dog became stranded himself on the creek after a frozen patch of ice broke off. Neither the man nor the dog actually went into the water. And again, both are doing just fine. Now let's get a check on the forecast with meteorologist Katie Fellinger. Katie, looks like a wintry mix is moving in. It is. It'll be arriving through the afternoon and evening time frame. So we've got a winter weather advisory that takes effect shortly after lunchtime, as early as 1 p.m., as late as 4, as this all moves in from west to east. So it'll also expire in staggered timing. But the point is that everyone is fair game for this wintry weather. Just because the Poconos don't have a winter weather advisory doesn't mean you won't see anything, but you're going to see a very light amount of snow. It's not going to meet the threshold to issue an advisory. The further south you go where the temperatures are much more marginal with freezing. However, you end up with this mixed bag and that's where the concern comes in when it comes to icing for the evening commute, especially now beyond this point. It's actually all out of here late tonight. By tomorrow, we're back to sunshine and nice warming trend 44 degrees and then even tail end of the week. Look at Friday, especially 60 degrees. The current call the trade off again is that there's a new storm, but that will be bringing in just some rain to the area. It looks like it could be a steady rain, no less, but uh, it's definitely a nice change of pace from the harsh cold that we've experienced in days past. For help, I'll take it, Katie. Thank you. And remember, you can always get Katie's most up-to-date forecast and the latest stories right here on cbsphilly.com. That's the latest for the Morning Digital Brief. I'm Rahel Solomon. Good morning.